2013 Oscars. Do you think it's an Illuminati? Do you think that the movies are, the songs are, the actors and actresses, that it's just a club of bloodline? Do you think that? Could it be? Hmm, let's see. I guess I'm not sure. What's up with this red carpet? Is this red carpet everywhere? Is it a bloodline? Is there a connection? Are they related? Are they related or not? That's the question. Are these people, please let me know, is there evidence, are there signs, there has to be something to prove it. There has to be a consistent amount of evidence, of symbols. What is up with this Oscar device? I don't understand. And who else do we know that has a red carpet and a sword? It must be the Queen of England. Is the Queen of England Illuminati? Hmm, let's think about it. Can we Google it and figure out if we can figure out if she is? Because many actors and musical artists claim that they are. Do you remember Star Trek? Yeah, the guy from Star Trek was even there on the red carpet. The Oscars, the movies, the actors and actresses, who wins, who runs Hollywood. YouTube has a billion amount of minutes of evidence. There's symbolism. Symbolism hitting your conscience and subconscious, and they know it. That's why they usually show it in the screen, but not in the main part. But nowadays, they show it everywhere. But like I said, is it Illuminati? What do you guys think about this red carpet, about the event? First, the Super Bowl, which showed a lot of one eyes at the Pepsi halftime countdown, like Lady Gaga showing her one eyes, and that is the sign of the devil, and he has many other symbols. He tries to flaunt in a statue that they made, just like him, and Madonna did the same thing at the Super Bowl, but is it all just a coincidence? Is the lady in red a coincidence? That's the question. You tell me. I'm not going to tell you. You tell me. Is it a coincidence? Because I, I see a lot of this stuff. Every day. It just can't be a coincidence. Or can it? Who knows? You tell me. Where's the evidence? What do you think? The lady in red that they always dress them up in. Yeah. Like the what they were wearing at the Grammys. Beyonce in her red and black. Rihanna in her red, Alicia Keys in her black, they dress them in red. The ones that join, is that true? Are they dressing them in red nowadays? Is that what's going on? <laughs> you tell me. Sort of communicating with the so spirit. do you think they're really acting? Do you think they really have talent? And when I came out, I was in charge. Powerful scene. Powerful scene. It, it was, I, I couldn't have acted that. I couldn't have written that down oh, really? made a decision to play that. What, are you going to smoke that? Nope, you are. Yeah, so he goes bad and then he wins something, right? Because <laughs> they want to promote am. that. Yeah, Jesus freak. Yeah, Jesus freak. The one-woman entertainment empire known as Oprah has strong affiliations with the demonic Oprah realm. Wants her the own most church. familiar face on television says, You can not only you use know your she's body part of physical that. self. Don't even act this like you don't know that. Acting. But, I ask my body hey, to maybe I'm just guessing, right? Maybe I don't even know. What do you think? You let me know. The is there the evidence? The for Can you character? YouTube it? YouTube their names and type Illuminati, figure it out. Calling out for these entities to maybe, take her over not. so that she may become a sparkling you tell puppet. Me in the comments. Oprah admits let of her work know. before the camera. I tried to empty myself and let the spirit inhabit me. With her global influence, her shows have become a smorgasbord for the New Age agenda. But... We'll see. If I see anything crazy, I'll make a follow-up video. But it's all just too weird. Seriously.